guys it's Saturday it's like 2 30 almost I just got home from work uh, I have not been vlogging that much this week so sorry about that this week's vlog might be a bit boring um, but anyways I just kind of wanted to pop on here for a second uh, I was gonna go grocery shopping but I'm too lazy um, so I'm gonna do that tomorrow and right now Gustavo and I are going to head to the mall because I need to get some swimsuit bottoms um, I tried on a swimsuit at Torrid a couple days ago and I absolutely loved it but um, it just I didn't get it that day because it just wasn't in my budget that day and I'm trying to stick to my spending limit schedule because I'm doing so good paying off my credit cards so I am gonna go back and get the bottoms today and then I'm gonna get the top next week so I'm really excited and then I also have to get some stuff I, I don't know if I told you guys I think in the previous vlog uh, that I have a photo shoot this week on Thursday it's kind of like an all-day thing and I need to go get some things for it so I'm really excited and yeah that's pretty much the biggest update I have right now so I'm going to change get ready and we're gonna head to uh, the mall and get some things and I'm not sure but I also need to eat because I'm starving so I'll check in with you guys in a bit hey guys uh, I am in forever 21 right now and I wanted to kind of show you guys the things that I am trying on I absolutely love this top um, and I think I might have to get it it's super super cute I feel really weird I guess this is kind of like a little try on in forever 21 so yeah let's get started so i feel really really good in this top it makes me feel very very confident um it's showing tummy but not too much tummy that's out of my comfort zone and i think it just gives my body a good shape so that's the back i love these jeans these jeans make my butt look great they don't really look my butt doesn't really look this great in real life <laughs> So the next thing that I'm trying on, this is actually from the Forever 21 Plus section. It's a 0X. Um, I do struggle because I have a very much smaller chest area, so uh, everything else seems to fit me very well, and the chest area seems to be a little baggy, but I'm also not wearing the correct bra, so if I get the strapless bra, um, I think it would work fine. But I think this is very cute as well. They have it in red. I think I might get it in red or... I'm not sure. This does actually go good with my hair tone. Um, but I just tucked it into my high-waisted pants. And yeah, that is this one. Uh, the next thing is just a simple tank top. I need a tank top to wear to the photo shoot, the photo shoot that I told you guys about for next week. Um, so it's actually really nice. I really like this lace detail. I think it's only like $7.50. This is also from the plus size section. It's a 0X. Um, and I think it's just really good quality. It's really cute. Um, yeah, it's just very, very simple. So I think I'm gonna get this for the photo shoot next week because um, they're gonna provide the clothes for us, but they told us to come in tank tops and shorts. So I think I will get this tank top. These shorts are actually from the Forever 21 Plus section as well. They're a size 16. They're too big on me without the belt, but I just belted it with my belt that I got from Urban Outfitters a couple months ago. And I actually like the way they look with the belt. It makes it look like they're meant to be baggy, like that high top, like mon shorts almost so I, I really like these um, I think I'm gonna get these and wear this outfit to the photo shoot next week okay guys so I completely forgot that I brought these jeans into the dressing dressing room and I am pleasantly surprised that they fit I usually have to go to like consignment stores and find like um, like vintage Levi's which is what I was wearing uh, earlier in the last clip. Um but these fit surprisingly well. This is the plus section, size 12. Um, I'm pleasantly surprised. The only thing I always struggle with is that little gap right there, which isn't a big deal. I can just belt that. But for the most part, I mean, they look pretty good. So, they, my tummy looks good. Butt check, butt looks good. The true test is when you bend down like this. And yes, there's a lot of elastic, so A plus. Oh my god, you guys, this is so cute together. And I'm gonna have to make some decisions. I can't get all this stuff. Uh, this is why you don't go into Forever 21 or into any clothing store when you don't plan on buying stuff. <laughs> because as women, we just can't help ourselves. But it just, it's so cute. So I was good. I did not end up getting the uh, jeans and the t-shirt from the last clip even though I really really wanted them because I'm working on that impulse buying. Um, I'm going to go back in a couple of weeks and really look at more jeans and make a decision that way. But uh, I will say that 
Oh, we're gonna go into Nike and I can't film in there. Um, but I will say that Forever 21's uh, plus size jeans have definitely gotten way, way better quality. So if you're looking for plus size jeans, I would check out Forever 21 because they're super affordable uh, and they fit very well. <laughs> Guys, good morning. <laughs> it's Valentine's Day. Gustavo doesn't want to be on camera. But he took the day off today, so we're spending the day together. Stop tickling me. So we're spending the day together. <laughs> we're just going to relax. I got up early and I posted my story time video about my experience working at Disney. So I'm already all done. It's like just a couple of minutes after 9. We're going to relax. And we have early, early dinner reservations at 3 o'clock at an Italian restaurant. So we're going to have a chill day, go to dinner. And then we're going to come back. I think we're going to go to Redbox and rent a movie. Um, so yeah, just fun relaxing. I'm really, really looking forward to it. Uh, and then I have to get up super, super early tomorrow for um, a photo shoot. So really excited. And maybe I can share with you guys my complete Valentine's Day look later in this vlog. Happy Valentine's Day, Cleo baby. You feel left out? Say hi to our viewers. She's like, no. You get the butt. <laughs> Okay, bye. <laughs> Alright guys, I'm having some breakfast. This is my favorite breakfast at the moment. So I have a whole wheat English muffin. I just put some butter on it. And then uh, I did two eggs. And Gustavo is scaring the crap out of my cat. <laughs> uh, two eggs. Um, half, on, half of a small avocado. And I just cut up some potatoes. And did some salt and pepper. So it's really good. Really simple. And it's really filling because you still have your carbs. Um, and then the avocado is the healthy fat. Sometimes I put cheese, but sometimes cheese doesn't agree with me. So uh, I'm going with the avocado option because it doesn't upset my stomach. So it's really good. Hey guys, so I just got home from the gym. Gustavo Gustavo went to wash his car. So I figured I would go get in a quick workout. I didn't work out that long. Uh, I just did the treadmill for a little bit and I did some stretches um, and a couple ab workouts. And I feel really good. So I'm going to start getting ready soon uh, for dinner. For, like I said, we're going super early at 3 o'clock, which I'm really happy about. Because um, then we can come home and loud and just kind of be lazy for the rest of the day. But in the meantime, I can show you guys my Valentine's Day outfit. So this is my Valentine's Day outfit super simple um, I'm wearing it with a pair um, I'm wearing this shirt that I showed in my haul earlier in the vlog from Forever 21 so it's kind of like a crop top type red shirt I didn't even buy it for Valentine's Day it just ended up working out that way it's really cute um, and flirty I think and then I'm wearing it these are like high top like flowy like kind of like jean looking pants they're not jean material but they're really like thin material um, I got these at Urban Outfitters a couple months back and I absolutely love them and I didn't know what to wear them with um, so I tried it on yesterday and they actually look really well together. Look it, Gus Gus went and got me flowers. He didn't wash his car. <laughs> Not one thing of flowers, but two. <laughs> Why'd you give me two things of flowers? I love you, you too. Oh, he's so sweet. I should have known you weren't washing your car because it's raining. <laughs> Which would defeat the purpose of washing your car. Hey guys, this is my Valentine's Day outfit. I wanted to show you guys what it looked like. All together so like I said this is my forever 21 top um, and then my high top very baggy pants that I got from Urban Outfitters a couple of months ago and then these shoes I think I got them at Payless I just wearing flats because it's cold outside uh, and I will kind of show you guys my makeup look in the car because we are running late so I thought I'd show you guys my makeup right here Gustavo is bringing the car around this is really Good lighting so I actually decided to go with just very very simple makeup um, less bold than my makeup tutorial I was just kind of feeling like I wanted to be more natural today so um, I just used my naked palette my naked uh, smoky eye palette and I used some natural brown tones and I did use a couple red tones as well and then I just used my NYX uh, lap uh, lap my NYX matte lipstick uh, ruffle trim it's my favorite it's my everyday lipstick um, and this is the final look you guys, we are totally sparging tonight. This is deep fried ravioli. Gustavo's in the restroom, so I'm gonna wait for him. But this is actually an appetizer that they have on the menu. It's a place called Rigatoni's here in uh, Arizona. So we are going to dig into this in a second. I am so excited. Hey guys, good morning. It is like 
7 o'clock in the morning. I've been up since 4.30. It is the day of the photo shoot that I told you guys about. I'm going to see if they'll let me vlog my experience. Um, if not, I'll tell you guys about it, but I'll keep you guys posted. Hey guys, uh, so they said I could vlog a little bit here, so I'm going to kind of like vlog my experience because my first like actual photo shoot, but it's for um, a place called The Henna Shop here in Arizona. Um, so I'm going to go about to get some body art done and then we're going to get started. So I'll see what I can vlog throughout this process. It is now about 20 till 6 o'clock, so it's about 5.40 p.m. at night. I just got out of the shoot. I've been here since 7 a.m., so I am so, so, so tired, but it was so much fun. I loved it. Um, I literally probably have like 20 tattoos all over my body. My other hand looks just like this. I have a hummingbird on this arm. I have um, a jellyfish on this arm. I have a full back tattoo. I have uh, a thigh tattoo. I have all this stuff down here. It's it's crazy. It's so cool though. Um, I was so nervous to come to this shoot because I had never been to like a real actual legit modeling um, thing and, and um, I was just in my head too much. I had so much fun. All the models were super sweet. Everybody was super sweet. Um, and yeah, I just had so much fun. I'm sitting in my car in the parking lot because I just wanted to kind of give you guys an update before I went home. Um, but yeah, everybody was really sweet. I hope that I can do stuff more stuff like this in the future um, Because modeling is something I've definitely always wanted to get into especially um, With the whole body positivity movement that I'm trying to get into as well because um, I think more um, I think more body sizes should be represented in the media and um, I believe my body type is one of them Everybody's body type should be rep represented in the media because we're all worthy and we're all beautiful So it was such an honor to be able to be a part of this um I don't know if I talked about it in the beginning of the vlog or in the beginning of the photo this morning, um, but the photo shoot was for a local um, henna shop. It's called the Henna Shop here in Arizona. There's actually six locations, I think, and I think if I remember correctly, it started in Tempe. So it's really cool. Obviously, it was for a henna shop, um, but yeah, it was just a lot of fun. Um, th uh, they gave us some cool gifts, so um, yeah, I'm rambling now, so I'm gonna go home. Th it's because of lack of sleep, guys, so I'm gonna go home. I'm gonna sleep great tonight. And I'll see you guys in the next clip. Okay, bye. 
Hey guys, it is Saturday night and I wanted to officially hop on here and end this vlog because I'm getting ready to edit it actually so that I can post it tomorrow morning or today as you're watching this on Sunday and I realized that I never officially ended it. So I'm going to end it here. I hope you guys enjoyed my experiences this week. I had a lot of fun. I'm so tired but it was so worth it. Um, I had so much fun at my first modeling thing and I'm still absolutely covered in henna pretty much from head to toe. I think I counted and I have like 21 tattoos on my body so it's pretty awesome. I loved it. I enjoyed it and I hope you guys enjoyed watching my experience and like always, I will see you guys in my next video. Bye. Fire, fire.